Riding the crest of the Latin music and dance craze of the 1950s, West Side Story won 10 Academy Awards. featured a breakthrough performance by a young Puerto Rican singer, actress, and dancer, Rita Moreno. Rita Moreno, to me, was an inspiration. When I first saw her in West Side Story, just that one person in that one role inspired me to go and do all the things that I've been able to accomplish. And it was because she was loving them, you know, because it made me feel like, well, if she could do it, I can do it. What she did was so amazing because it's something that she had to take, it's something that she had to fight for. And for me, that is very inspirational. When I see Jennifer and the other wonderful young actresses, I envy them because they didn't have the kind of struggle that I did. I had a fight for every little part, every little movie. Everything had to be fought for. We came to New York way before that big influx of Puerto Ricans came to America. So there were very few Hispanic kids around. It was tough. It was really tough. I experienced verbal abuse, garlic mouth, here's dear, and spit a lot, a lot. I didn't know what they meant at first because I didn't speak English yet. But the expression on the children's faces was a very mean one. So even as a young girl, I really felt that I was a very inferior person. The way I felt about myself was connected to the way people related to me, including in Hollywood. How about it, little flower? I think there is a curse on us. I bring it with me. If only I hadn't had to speak with an accent every single time that I was in a movie. Every single time. I was the house ethnic. I played East Indian girls, I played Polynesians, Arabian girls, but they all sounded the same. If she was Polynesian, she talked like this. If she was Arabian, she talked like this too. Mrs. Anna, please, you have some English books I can read? Yes, of course, my dear, but they're not unpacked yet. So it was demeaning, and it was undignified. And why did I do it? Because I wanted to be in the movie so badly. And I figured that one day, I really believed that one day somebody would say, this girl has talent. When is not yet, Rita? The first time I ever played a Puerto Rican was in West Side Story. Sometimes I don't know which is bigger, your skull or your accent. All through my early life, I had no role models. There weren't any. They didn't exist in movies or radio. I found out that Anita became my role model. I think I go back to San Juan. I know a boat you can get on. Bye bye. Uh, everyone there will give big cheers. Yeah. Everyone there will have moved here. Oh. This was a girl who had fire and grit and self-respect. I didn't have a whole lot of that for many, many, many years. Oscar Knight. I really didn't think I would win. The nominees for Best Performance by an Actress in a Supporting Role are... When Rock Hudson came on stage for my category, I thought, my luck, my Puerto Rican luck, I'm going to be the one who doesn't get it. May I have the envelope, please? Rita Moreno and What's Our Story. Yeah.
that. I leave you with that. Ah, oh, there were so many things I could have said as a Latina. You know, it really bothered me for years after that that I didn't even think of that. But I was just so astonished, truly, for real. You know, I, it's come out of my tongue so easily now on behalf of every Hispanic person or every person of another minority. I want to say, uh, you know, thank you on everyone's behalf, all these people who have struggled for so many years, and you see it can happen. That's what I would have said, but... Uh, <laughs> Rita Moreno was the first Latina ever to win an Academy Award. And the original cast recording of West Side Story became the best-selling album of the decade.